tuned in to 98.4 Capital FM and this is Hits Not Homework with John Fame, Anita Ndaru, myself, Anne Mora and Tracy Wanjuru. And of course, it's Takeover Thursday and you know what that means. You have to send in your request real early so John Fame can play them just for you. And it is Reggae Raga and Ruse all hours long. And of course, we have to talk about money because that's been the theme of our week. So, uh, Anita. Yes. I was telling you this story, right? Mm-hmm. So we're going to talk about the luck of money. Um, so an 18-year-old girl bought her first lottery ticket and now she wins $1,000 a week for the rest of her life. She bought her what? first Jesus, lottery does ticket. This happened to everybody else yeah. except me. Is she looking for an adopted sister? I don't even know. You know, know. I don't know. Just I at this point, whatever she needs in her life. Right. Wow, that's amazing. Some people just seem to be lucky with money. $1,000 for the rest of your life. She you just you don't 18. need to work. Yeah. Literally, because that's like what, a hundred and three thousand shillings mm-hmm. every single week. My God, a hundred k a week for Jesus. the rest of your life. That is the so wait, luck but you of told money. Me she was given an option. So the op- so option was either she can get seven hundred and eighty thousand mm-hmm. dollars all in, at once, or a thousand dollars for the rest of her life I every single hope week. She went with a lot. She went with the thousand dollars every single week. So I want to talk about money because you know that's been the theme of the week. We've been talking about money in the industry, money in the films, all of this. Hey, John Farmer wants to also chime in the conversation. Joe, yeah. if you were given a thousand dollars every week, week for the rest of your life, would mm. you still DJ? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Four hundred k. That's not a lot of money. A hundred. A hundred k a week. Yeah. Four hundred k. Oh. That's not a lot of money. For okay, for some of us. No the ordinary Kenyan. No, that's I mean I wouldn't resign from week. my job, but still, k online hours. shopping would be lit. And then? No, but for the Anita, rest of my life. Anita, how much are your shoes? A lot, a lot. You, you, you <laughs> can't, you can't sustain that lifestyle, though. No, True. Wait, how much? How much is a pair of shoe? Is that? Oh no, I don't, I don't go buying Christian Louboutins and stuff like that. Like, no, 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 no. Anita, be, you know uh, you, Anita. Wait, stop, try, stop trying to no, sell no, a no, fallacy. No, no, no. Stop Anita. trying no. to sell a fallacy. My shoes cost around ten grand or. Ten thousand, sendo. Yes. <laughs> okay, so that's ninety Gs. We'll be back here now, sendo. Yeah. Eh. Uh-huh. But every week. Online shopping will be lit, sendo. My online shopping will be lit. Yes, exactly. but I'll still have my capital salary, my NTV salary. So, so you're working. Fine. So you're yes. still working. You're still uh, hustling. Uh, sorry, no, yeah. I mean, but that's because you, know, you could also be an Instagram thotty and just but, make but, so but, much but, money. But, Some but, people make that in a week anyway. But but it depends on where your vision is. Right. True. For me, if I want, if I just wanted to be comfortable and I'm making four hundred k a month, a thousand dollars a week. I mean. Uh, Nico Sawa. Yeah. Hey, you, to be you, fair, you, you, that is yeah, a lot yeah. of money. At least you can you can you can afford to you can, sustain you can afford to mortgage a house. You, not buy yeah. mortgage, but you know, mortgage to yeah. buy. But it does feel like some people are just lucky with money. I mean she just turned eighteen. This is madness. This was her gift oh, to herself. Oh, 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 at 18, she had just at turned eighteen. Work, work for who? For right? no, you know how much just turned eighteen. 18, 19, like a month 20, ago. You're probably in uni and then, then you graduate when work. you're twenty one. No, but this is the thing. And this is one of the reasons why I've always told my friends I don't think I can be a kept wife. I'd be bored out of my mind if I didn't have a job. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>